Police swarming Charlestown High School. Gunshots ringing out nearby, clearing out the pack stands, cutting graduation short for students. WBZ's Christina Hager has been on scene all afternoon, and Christina, certainly not how students expected their big day to go. Yeah, David, police have been out here searching the area and collecting evidence in the neighborhood while crews have now broken down the commencement setup that was here on the field and sadly ended up right next to a crime scene. We want to hear gunshots at their graduation, so. Balloons and blue graduation gowns mixed with blue flashing lights and police dogs. I'm sad because of the. I can get my diploma. Graduates were set up on these chairs on the Charlestown High School athletic field when from behind the bleachers where family members were cheering them on, gunshots. It was kind of a quick thing. I seen, I heard three to four shots. Um, I looked back and he started running towards, you know, the opposite direction of where he shot. Everyone ran around and everything got really hectic really quickly. We all ran and was trying to take cover, literally. A block away on Polk Street, bullet holes in a shattered car window. On the sidewalk, a magazine for ammunition. One person taken to the hospital, but no injuries from gunshots. It was enough to stop the graduation ceremony at the most important moment, just as grads were about to get diplomas. They was starting to say the names and everything, but it started like the sounds, it started the first shoot, and then it started like again, again, again. In a statement, Superintendent Brenda Caselius said, it's devastating that senseless acts of violence in the community interrupted what was meant to be a joyous occasion. Boston Mayor Michelle Wu put out a statement also calling the situation devastating and unacceptable. She says graduation will be rescheduled. In Charlestown, Christina Hager, WBZ News.